Hello everyone, Mikey Dare Panzerate here with 36, episode 36 of Hearts of Iron 4 Turkey. Our planning bonus is ready, so we're going to attack across the straits here. Um, or, yep, across the straits and try and take Amori. Uh, Amori, I'm just going to call it Amori. And the rest of Japan. So, our troops have landed on the Japanese home islands. Now we're finally in contact with the enemy. And again, this is kind of our Turkish Hail Mary here to defeat the Empire of the Rising Sun. And we can get some better... We can get some better shell types. Oh, cruiser Heavy Cruiser, Battle Cruiser. We can get some better shell types for our ship. So what is that? Is that a armor piercing cap shell? Super heavy armor piercing shell, medium, semi armor piercing. Yeah, uh, semi armor piercing ammo is fantastic if you play World of Warships and you play the Italian cruisers. And uh, they're going to come out with Italian battleships with SAP and they just keep nerfing it because it's powerful. Like, this is what you need to do. What? Why are you. Oh, no, go here. What are you doing? Oh, is there like a Japanese naval force over here? What is going on? Why are you walking? Why are you taking the railroad? Are you gonna like sail around? So this is ocean, ocean, shallow sea. Huh. Just don't get cut off. I want half of you to stay. For half of you to go attack them. Yeah, I don't want any nonsense from that. Okay. So here we are. In Japan. We have quite the air battle going on. We have no air superiority whatsoever. But our ground forces are doing a good job. Which is very nice. I like it. I like what's going on here. We have them on retreat in all fronts. Our submarines are getting reinforced. Our regular navy is getting reinforced. What is going on? Yeah, y'all need to like I'm going to micromanage a little bit to make sure our front line doesn't get too, like, messed up. Yeah. Make sure we, like, maintain our front lines and all of that. Cut off the Japanese. Okay. So that would be good if we could cut off some Japanese troops. If not, no big deal. And uh, hopefully our allies can take out China and then we can end this war. And then we can end this series and move on to something else. Turkey has been a lot of fun, but, you know, late game Hoi is a little ridiculous. I will say, which is a shame. I, I In all games, like Minecraft, World of Warships, Stellaris... Uh, civilization like I, I like the late game the late games the like the early game is the most played because you always start games so you don't necessarily get to the late game but but I'm a late game guy I like late game Sendai so Japan is getting invaded by yours truly and we're just gonna let it roll all right I want to spread the love out a little bit with our trading of iron I don't want to be completely reliant on the United States. I want to build some trade relationships with some of my other allies, you know, try and be a good guy. Oh, and look, France has landed in the south. Good job, France. Aux armes, citoyens, formé. All right, if we don't get our Navy involved in this war, we never will. So, we are going to 
Have you? Convoy raid. I want you to convoy raid all around Japan. Good luck, soldiers. Good luck, sailors of the Turkish Navy. Of the Turco Dononamasi or whatever. Make the Osmanoglus proud. Remember your heritage as um, as Ottomans, and you cut them off. Try and cut off their military. You should do like the same thing. Take over that little derpy island. So there we go. We shall rule the Europe. That's what I just. That's what I hear when he says that. Oh, uh, we shall rule the Europe. <laughs> Not quite. All right, semi armor piercing shell. Excellent. I want to get those because most of our forces are destroyers. Hey, would you look at that? All right, let's make sure y'all are assigned to this. So you need to do that. You need to do that. Y'all need to Im increase this, and y'all need to increase the pressure on them. We shall roll your up. So make sure y'all get them completely cut off. And destroy a large portion of the Japanese home island army. And do good things for bringing them down. Region, okay. We're gonna remember this. Region, why, um... Diabarkari, or whatever. I yeah, this place. Former Kurds land, but we're we're friends with the Kurds now. We're good. We're friends, right? Right. Um, we need more steel. And we need more aluminum. We'll get more aluminum from Russia. Again, we're trying to rebuild Russia, and we'll rebuild India too with getting some steel from them. Excellent work. Okay. Now let's get our naval doctrine up. Excellent. Oh yeah, look at that army getting just wrecked. Right. I want to race, like not. Let's race them to Osaka. Let's go. Onward to victory, armies. Armies of the Turkish Republic. Republic of Turkey. Destroy them. Oh, yeah. oh, 7 million casualties. They were like 4 million the last time I checked. I don't know if we have inflicted 3 million here. I mean, probably this fighting has done some stuff too. But Australia and New Zealand, do not fear. Your liberation is at hand. If nothing else, we're just going to make Japan surrender and give you back. It is, I, I, I do see benefit, though, to... Um, I do see a lot of benefit to, you know, walking or to, like, physically liberating places. Like, having your troops march in and help. I mean, you don't necessarily want, like, a brutal battle or anything. But, all right, maybe we won't beat them to Osaka. Maybe let's edit this. Just, just, just to Nagoya, I guess. Oh, no, we, don't, we didn't bring in our go-go Turkish tankers, though. Oh, well. Oh, well. Uh, yeah, don't, I don't really care about any of this, so we're just gonna say, anyone else you can do, like, do like that. So, um, have fun, enjoy, armor piercing cap shell, excellent, you should take Nagoya. Get better shells for our navy. It, are they are they getting combat experience? I don't know, but I'm enjoying this. Like y'all need to like do that. So Japan, I think I think we're gonna end the war this episode. Is this the last episode of the series? Oh, I mean, I'm gonna miss it. I'm not really gonna miss it. I'm gonna miss it a little bit. 
Are we seriously gonna beat the French? No, the French got Osaka. Okay. Japan capitulated. Boys, we got him. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, yes. Denmark. I love it, Denmark. And uh, now all they got to do is take Zhengzhou. We're going to have you all. I don't know. Let's have everyone here come to Tokyo Harbor. Or we're going to celebrate the surrender of them on board the TCG Yav Yavuz. We're going to have them surrender. It's like the Missouri, but for Turkey. Okay. So, um, will they take out the reorganized government of China? Because that's what they need. They're 98% towards capitulation. Hi. Um, you want to die? France! Go get them! <laughs> what are you doing? Do I have to do that? Like, I mean, I'll send my troops here, but like, I don't think they're necessary. Like, come on. So you can do that. Whenever you get there, I mean, you're you're gonna get there in, you know, two months. We probably should have used these guys to help take out Spain, but that's fine. All right, so everyone in Tokyo Bay, ready for the surrender ceremony. We're just waiting on China to surrender. Come on, France. Come on. You have no opposition. None. Or Putin. Or who's the Russian guy? Sergei. Alexander. Damn it. Close enough. Close enough. You'll know you want to. Come on. Oh, is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Yes! Oh, there's like literally nothing left for me to do. So we're just gonna... Okay, well, that's fine. But uh, the surrender will be signed on board our Turkish ship. Or at least the local surrender. Oh boy. What's gonna happen? How ugly is this world gonna be? How ugly. It's, it's, it's loading. Like, the game's struggling. Yep, calculating effects. Okay. Total score, we came in 13th. We're below Germany, that's pathetic. Argentina didn't even fight. Like, okay. Army, not great. Navy, not great. Air Force, okay. So we're, we have a, hey, look at that. Industry, land score. That's fine. Um, we didn't do great, but we did our part. So... Let's look at this. Okay, this isn't terrible. Who's this? Republic of China. Republic of China. Oh, God. Chinese Republic. <laughs> Hoi Republic. Xinjiang Independent Republic. Okay. Um, Pakistan is separate from the Dominion. Republic of Thailand. Australia, New Zealand. Welcome back, you sexy bastard. John Curtin survived and... Peter Fraser, never heard of you. Seems like a generic name. But all of the uh, random deals in Hawaii is an American puppet. Who wait, who's the, who's in charge of this? Joseph Pondexter. Hmm. What about this? Mariana Federation. Okay, so everyone's back. All that's left to do is to bring the troops home. That's what we're going to do. I'm gonna bring the troops home. Y'all can all like get spread out all over the place. We're gonna enjoy this. We didn't even take we didn't even take any land for ourselves. This is how good we're the good guys, okay? We are absolutely the good guys. What? Other treaties? Please don't start any other wars. You can Ankara. You we from Istanbul. Let me get our navies to not be assigned here. But I want y'all to be 
all over here. I just don't. I just, just come, just come home, Gary. Come home. You go there. You go there. And you the same thing. We don't need you over here. Although I guess we are protecting the golf, but that's fine. I'm gonna have you come to the Aegean, and I want you to come to Istanbul. So that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Hearts of Iron 4 Turkey. Before anything else goes wrong, we're going to um, <coughs> change some of our procedures and whatnot. Uh, we don't need that. But we do need like a bunch of steel. So America, help America. So America's gonna float our economy for now. And 1950, when World War II finally ended, this is what the world looks like. We are basically factions with everyone. Mongolia is still holding onto the communist dream. We can change that. We, we, can, we can try and change that. Let's, um, oh, the Intel network. Resistance control trade, diplomatic pressure. Yeah, come to Mongolia. That, that'll be cool. So, if you enjoyed this series, be sure to leave a like, not just on this episode, but on the first episode. Really helps with the search engine optimization. Also, leave a like. Yeah, yeah, leave a like. Oh, no. No more wars. We'll let, this, we'll let the United Kingdom deal with this. Um... For all intents and purposes, the war is over. The war is over. Lord Sidious promised us peace. Fine, we'll we'll deal with it. Okay, so enjoy. We're at war again somehow. Because Norway decided to go fascist. Okay, but yeah, be sure to subscribe and you know like and hit the notification bell. Join the Discord server link down below. That's where I talk about like what's coming up next or ask you for ideas. I think I know what I'm going to do next. Um, yeah, and become a patron like James, who's sponsored a lot of these videos. I've had other patrons come and go, but I, I thank all of them for their support. And then channel members. Channel member. You want to be a channel member before you become a patron, unless you can't afford the full $5 a month or whatever it is. You pay more than that for Netflix, and you watch, you know, this a lot. And I hope I brought you in, in entertainment and enjoyment. And, uh... I hope you'll join me in the next series. Thank you all so much for watching. And until then, this is Mikey Darpanzernator. I'm not going to care about this Norwegian war. Signing out. See ya, nerds.